Hi, my name is Patrick, and in this video, we're going to go over your scheduling settings. To get started, click on Setup, then click on Scheduling Settings. This first tab deals with your online scheduling, and you can decide if you want to allow clients to be able to book an appointment with you online. Once you've clicked yes, this is a clinic-wide setting. However, you can turn online scheduling on or off for each practitioner and for each service. You will also have the option to display a custom message to your client before they book an appointment with you. And within this text box, you can include any information you think is important to your client before they book an appointment. And next, you can now decide where you want to add your book appointment button. You can either add this directly to your website or add this to your Facebook or Instagram page. The next tab is your cancellation policy. From this dropdown, you can decide the time frame your clients have before they can cancel or reschedule their appointment. 24 hours before their appointment is the most common cancellation policy. From this page, you can also decide if you have a no-show or late cancellation fee. Once you click yes, you will see you have three options on how you can set up this fee. It can either be a flat fee, and you can add the fee amount here, or a percentage of the service price, or if it's the full amount of the missed appointment. The next tab are your scheduling rules. These first two questions are similar and help you configure how you want to treat appointments from new clients or existing clients. You can either automatically add their appointments to the calendar or review the request before accepting. If you decide to review the request before accepting, your clients are gonna receive an email telling them that the appointment is pending. And then once you approve the appointment, they're going to receive another confirmation email telling them that the appointment has been confirmed. This next option allows you to configure how far into the future your clients are able to book an appointment. And from this last drop down, you can configure how soon before the start time can your clients book an appointment with you. This last tab is your no show guard, and this deals with payment settings and payment settings are going to be covered in another video. So these are your scheduling settings. I do hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to email us at support at clinicsense.com.